don't think I've seen you around. That means you must be new to Stellar Bay. You are new here, right? I knew it! See, I made what you call a logical deduction. You must have seen those UDL gunships on your way in. There's only three of them these days. Still, they tend to scare folk off. You may not have heard, you being new, but Stellar Bay hardly ever gets off-world traffic. Us being cut off by the board and all. Which means I never get to do this part, but I've been practicing, so here goes. On behalf of Monarch Stellar Industries, welcome to Stellar Bay, home of the freshest sal tuna in Halcyon. Please state your name for the record. Swell. There's one for the logs. I'm even going to give you your own entry code. I'm not supposed to do that. It's against procedure, but Mr. Sanjar isn't so strict about the rules here. Besides, I got a lot of empty entries to fill. We don't get ship traffic in town. Only off-worlders who do make it out here are sublight. They got a base in Fallbrook. And thank the stars for them, or we would have run out of Rizzo's Purple Berry Crunch years ago. Oh, that'll just make Mr. Sanjar's day if you tell him. The board makes up lots of nasty stories about raptodons and cannibals and whatnot. But that's all outside our- Oh, sure. It makes Stellar Bay sound like a rotten place, but it's not so bad. Get a good breeze going, and the sulfur smell mostly covers up the fishy smell. Anyway, Mr. Sanjar's got Mr. Sanjar- Oh! And if you're headed that way, maybe you could. I got this Rizzo's Rangers Tossball poster coming in on the next sublight shipment, signed by the Black Hole himself. Only I haven't heard anything in a while. You. Th That's Bertie Holcomb, only one of the greatest Tossball hackers ever. I wonder if he's kin. Dad had family that worked for Rizzo's. I never got to meet them. Everyone's heard of him, even on Monarch. We still get some of the games. You've been living in a sulfur pit or something? On account of him being the best hacker who ever played, nothing gets by him. Well, Holcomb's had a lot of nicknames over his career. He used to be the tallywhacker on account of what he'd do to the score. Before that, he was the slick stick, because the shots were always... I swear I'm not. At the start of his career, people called him the hack boss, but no one thought that was very catchy. I couldn't really say I'm just a fan of the... But the fancy collector types say the more people see these things, the less valuable they are. And I figure my poster's been passed around by more than a few people by now. Thanks a bunch! Celia- Wouldn't mind smelling like Saltoon if we could sell more. What are the chances of all the times and places we could have been born? Yeah. We're here! Light years from Earth, going about our lives. Every time the punch clock peels, a worker earns his meals. What are you talking about? Sorry, I thought you were quoting, it's a wonderful directorate. Well, well. Isn't often we see new f Enjoy. If you plan on sitting through Nioka's stories, you might could use a few. I could use a few and tell it myself. Now what can I do for you? Anyone who spends any amount of time in this bar is bound to get to know Nioka. On account of her being here so often herself. And I don't mean that unkindly. Anyone who's rid us of as many beasts as you have is entitled to a few drinks. Something else I can do for you? Not since Amber Heights. These days we have more leaving than coming. 
Off to join the Iconoclasts or some such. Bunch of marauders broke into the executive compound, slaughtered everyone. Corporations pulled out of Monarch not long after. I thought everyone knew. But then that was ten years ago. Still feels fresh to us every time we look at our walls, though. But it had a fancy ring. Ah, uh, don't be so negative. It's what's on the inside that counts. Speaking of, you look like you could... And the little bastard slippery, right? On account of it getting so I can't tell the... Tell the blood from the mud. But I gotta get in there. Get right in that baby rap stomach and dig it out. If so much as a drop of stomach acid got on that medallion, I'd... Shit, I don't know what I'd do. Might be I'd hunt every damn wrapped out there. Right. What are you staring... Wait. You ain't from around here. Who are you? Ooh, charmer. Don't get a lot of that around here. Folks mostly grump at me about how I should join the MSI payroll. Nice change of pace. Buy me a drink, will you? Outstand! What are you doing in Stellar Bay, stranger? Well, 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 well. Let's get down to brass nuts then, shall we? Brad, I'm headed back out there after I sober up. You want a guide sooner than that? You'll have to get me something to clear my head. Outstanding! Our dispensary here maintains a stock. I'm cut off for the month on account of needing one just about every damn day. But I'm sure you've got your wily ways. Well, they work. We got a deal or what? You won't find a better deal in Halcyon than our special one-time offer for a refurbished sanitation unit. Remember... What in the... The thing talks? Velma seen out of sorts, too. She's always cranky. If Velma's capable of running the warehouse, she can certainly pick up her own. Hello, dearie. Why, I don't believe I. What can Auntie Abigail do for you? Bless your little heart. You must mean Catherine. Now, dearie, who's this pickup for? I'm so sorry, but with the iconoclasts and the marauder fi Our reserves have gotten so low, I've even had to start locking the supply room upstairs. Isn't it a shame what some people will do to get a little extra? Isn't it just... I'd make an exception for you if I could, my little cherub. <laughs> Is there... Orange, you a saucy thing! Now, I may not be a fresh young thing anymore, but... With... Much as I'd love to, my rheumatism is especially fierce at the moment, and I'm all out of my medicine. But I'd hate to send you away empty-handed. You were here for caffeine. Oh, 
It's none of my business, but I have told her Dr. Williams would bump up her monthly allotment if only she'd join MSI, contribute like the rest of us. Now I've gone and said too much. <laughs> I'm afraid not. Dr. Williams managed the town's allotments from his terminal upstairs. Even I can't access them. Oh, you flatter an old woman. Me, I'm just here to be a pretty face for the customers. And to keep an extra key to the supply room for all the times Dr. Williams misplaced his. The one upstairs. In the town graveyard, I'm afraid. Poor man was always searching for the flower of enlightenment. The graveyard's near the southern ruins. You're certainly welcome to pay our risk. Do be careful. Chin up. If Velma's capable of running the warehouse, she can certainly... Running the warehouse, she can certainly pick up her own cathanoid. Don't be so hard on her. With Brax missing, she's working doubles and needs a little edge. Very well, dearie. But you. Wrapped musk and canid eyes, right here. Please, will someone help me? My boy's in trouble. Oh, thank you for stopping. Everyone acts like nothing's wrong. Like my little... Please, you have to help me get my little Tucker back. He ran away and is going to get him... Don't you tell me to calm down. I promised my boy I'd protect him for always. But how can I keep him safe if he's run away? He ran out into the wilderness a few days ago. I warned him about the Raptodon. Oh, law, Captain. The youngster won't last. Please, won't you go? He's been pining for an adventure. Says he's tired of living cooped up behind the walls. But he doesn't understand how dangerous it is out there. I warned him. A raptodon would snap him up first chance of God. I just know one's rip his arm off and is gnawing on his sweet little fingers. He should have listened to his mom. Well, I, I, I guess I can't ask you to leave the town walls for free. It is deathly dangerous out there. I got some bits saved up for a rainy day. I'll give you every last one if you just bring my Tucker back to me. I won't even be mad at him running off. You tell him I, I won't be mad. He's been listening to those awful broadcasts. And now I just know my boys. That old settlement, southwest of Stellar... Or that he never... Or... Thank you. You look for him. And if you find any of them iconoclast... Rising. Concentrated amount of scum present ahead. You reckon the smell ever goes away? Give me the wind off the sea helps.
Feels like the old bits outside of Edgewater. Used up, needed, left to settle into ruin. Time to clean area estimated as six trillion. Five hundred for dirt alert! Dirt alert! Visitor? What an unex- Excellent. You've arrived at just the right time. Please, make yourself- Oh, hello. That's nice. We had someone- It just gets hard to remember things. I recall- I felt like that after my dad passed. Walked around in a haze for weeks. Other times it's like there's... fog. That's nice of you. I usually feel better after I eat. What a pleasant surprise. And just... yet... And who could? Stretch out your hand and cosmic divin- Just that your presence here is a gift to us, and one that we don't take for granted. Look at me. Liar! You're trying to The ones that come in a bottle with a rocket ship on it. I'm not telling you. Spacer's Choice Pills, they cure all your ills.
Earth. Risk of overload. Too much spillage. Contaminant level too extreme. Warning. Warning. I'm gonna be sick. But what's this? Oh dear. You've been no- Quickly, my dear. He's getting agitated. We can't let the meat spoil. Don't worry. We'll make this quick. Everybody with missing family will wonder if, if these people
like those old Sundays when we'd unload salt tuna shipments at the cannon. Deploying! Come to share a secret with Auntie Abigail? Come to share a secret with Auntie Abigail? <laughs> <laughs> 